Welcome back to our channel. Today we are covering question and answers on ServiceNow CAD. To find the complete list of question and answers, please go to the playlist link provided in the description. Our team is working hard to keep the content up to date. If you find this video helpful, please let us know in the comment. We really appreciate if you like and subscribe to our channel. Today question is Which of the following object does a display business rule not have access to? Option A. Previous Option B. Glide system Option C. G. Scratch pad And Option D. Current And the correct answer is Option A. Next question is when creating an application through the guided application creator, which of the following is not an option for creating a table? Option A. Create table from template. Option B. Create table from scratch. Option C. Extend a table. And option D. Upload a spreadsheet. And the correct answer is option C. A. Next question is Server side scripts manage what? Option A. Database and backend mo most voted. Option B. Playbook access. Option C. User access. And option D. Forms and fields. And the correct answer is option A. Next question is, which initiative development interface guides users through the initial application development process? Option A, guided tour designer. Option B, guided application creator. Option C, service now studio. And option D, Flow Designer. And the correct answer is option B. Next question is, what are some benefits of developing private scope applications? Choose two options. Option A, to avoid using a code repository like GitHub or GitLab. Option B, to reduce risk at code collisions. Option C. To enable installation and uninstallation of an application. And option D. To replicate service now functions a private scope. And the correct answer is option B. Next question is. What records are used to track cross scope applications or scripts that request access to an application, application resource or event. Option A. Restricted caller access records. Option B. Caller tracking records. Option C. Access control level records. And option D. Cross scope access records. And the correct answer is option A. Next question is, which ATF test steps allow you to create a user with speeded roles and groups for the test? Option A, create a group. Option B, impersonation. Option C, create a user. And option D, Create a role. The correct answer is option C. Next question is what plugin enables the guided application creator? Please go through the options. And the correct answer is option A. Next question is which of the following can be an external data source for a ServiceNow application? 
option a microsoft excel file option b data provided by a public web service using soap or rest option c csv file and option d all of the above the correct answer is option d next question is which one of the following is true for the application pico and application scope option a global is a reserved application which does not appear in the application pico option b collecting an application from the application pico does not set the application scope option c selecting an application from the application pico sets the application scope and option d selecting global in the application pico sets the application scope to incidence and the correct answer is option c next question is which of the following is an available feature in studio choose two options option a push to update set option b merge branches option c search code and option d push to external source control and the correct answer is option c next question is why would you build a custom app choose two options option a to avoid using a code repository like github or gitlab option b to replace service now based tables option c to fulfill a specific use case on internal processes and option d to create a custom integration for a third party system the correct answer is option c next question is which one of the following is not part of the form designer option a page head page header option b schema map option c field navigator and option d form layout the correct answer is option b next question is which of one of the following is true for a script include with a protection policy value of protected option a any user with pet protected edit role can see and edit the script include option b the protection policy option can only be enabled by a user with the admin role option c the protection policy is applied only if the glide app apply protection system property value is true and option d the protection policy is applied only if the application is downloaded from the service now app store the correct answer is option d next question is when designing and creating a form what do you create to organize fields on a form option a buttons option b tabs option c sections and option d related list the correct answer is option c next question is which one of the following is a good practice for adding a instructions to a form option a related links to wiki page option b a context menu ui action option c annotations and option d a populated read only field the correct answer is option c next question is which of the following glide record methods run a query against a database table choose three options option a get option b run query option c 
क्वेरी ऑप्शन डी अंडर स्कोर क्वेरी एंड ऑप्शन ई गेट द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज इन अ बिजनेस रूल विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग रिटर्न द एस वाई एस आई डी ऑफ द करेंटली लॉक इन यूजर ऑप्शन ए जी फॉर्म गेट यूजर आई डी ऑप्शन बी जी एस गेट यूजर एस वाई एस आई डी ऑप्शन सी जी एस गेट यूजर आई डी एंड ऑप्शन डी जी फॉर्म गेट यूजर एस वाई एस आई डी द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी Thank you